Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be updating your Safari on your Mac. So let's get started. This is Safari. So what we have to do now is go on top. You guys will see the very top left hand side of your screen. There's the Apple logo. So if you guys click on the Apple logo, you will see the second option where it says system preferences. Now, before this latest Mac OS, we used to update everything under the App Store. However, now it's split up between the App Store and system preferences. So let's just go right into system preferences, which is our second option. And this should pop up. So I'm gonna zoom in so you guys can see better. Now here, the third option down here below, you will see software updates. So let's just click right there. And then this should say checking for updates. So it will take a little bit. However, this update's so small that it will take you only about three to five minutes maximum. That's if you have slow internet. Other than that, it's gonna be seconds. So if you guys click on more info, you will see the description of this update, which is basically just about privacy and security and so on. It's not a humongous update. You're only looking at 68.9 megabytes, which is really nothing. So all we have to do right now, let me just zoom in a little bit. I'm gonna click on install now, or I could just click on update now. So just click on close application if you guys have it opened. If not, then you're all good. It's not gonna tell you that. So I had Safari in the back opened and that's why I told you that. However, right now it's just gonna download this. It's gonna restart and that's it. It's gonna restart the program, not the Mac itself. It's not one of those updates. It's a really, really quick update as well as you guys can see. If you guys are working something in Safari, which most of you, it's not your case really, then I wouldn't do this update just yet until you guys are done doing whatever you guys are doing in Safari. However, don't worry about your bookmarks and whatever saved websites you guys have in Safari. Nothing's gonna go away. This will not reset any of your Safari preferences that you guys have set up. So do not worry about that. Is this an update you guys can skip for now? Well, yeah, it's nothing immediate that you guys need for sure in your Safari. It does have some privacy and security updates to it. However, yes, you guys could skip it, do it another day, so don't worry about it. If you're watching this to see how long this will take, well, now you know. It's gonna take you guys most likely a minute or two, and then you're done. Anyways, right now it's up to date. I can open up Safari again, and it's all good. Anyways, that's it for this video tutorial. If you guys have any questions, comments, you guys can write down here in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.